I'm doing my first video today. And I'm gonna take my hair down while I read some questions. So this is gonna be a get to know me slash, it's a get to know me Q and A slash. Taking my hair down. Oh wow, I'm taking my hair down. So let's get into the questions. I'm gonna take this hair down. So question number one is what is your full name and age? My full name is Corbin Aaliyah Smith, uh, but you know, I just go by Corbin because only certain people really call me Aaliyah. It's like my mom. Um, my age, I'm 19. Gonna be 20. Gonna <laughs> be 20 soon. <laughs> well, when the new year come rolling around, I'm gonna be 20. Um, when is your birthday? My birthday is May 20th, baby. My zodiac sign is Taurus, Taurus gang. Uh -uh. Um, next question What is your favorite color? My favorite color is blue and gold. Just to let y'all know. Hope y'all remember that. Um, what's the other question? What talents do you have? Um, I can sing. Um, I'm funny as ever. I'm funny as hell. Um, I don't know if that's a talent, but that can't be a talent. The comedians get paid for that. Yeah, that is a talent. I'm funny. That's a talent. Um, what's the other question? What's the furthest you've been away from home? Um, I had stayed in Chicago. Like I went with myself. I didn't go with my mom. I didn't go with nobody. That was kind of the longest. I think that was up there for. A, it was almost a whole. It was kind of like a whole summer because we did so much stuff. So it was almost like a whole summer. That was the longest. Um, my favorite TV show. My favorite TV show at the moment, bitch, is Black Lightning. And um, what's the name? Black Lightning, All American. If y'all watch that, hit me up, comment, whatever. So we need to talk about that because that's my show. Oh, and I like Grownish. Grownish is my show. I like um. I miss Star and Empire. Uh, uh, uh. I really miss that show, like for real, for real, because that was my show. Like on the real, that was the show. Did anybody tell them to be bankrupt? Like who, who do I think y'all is? So if that's the case, you know, BET and VH1. Y'all need to pick up Star and BET. I mean, Star and Empire because that's the show and it should be on there. Next question. Um. Are you good at any sports? Yes, I'm good at swimming. I was on a swim team, junior and senior year. Well, I'm shit. senior year. I was only for a hot second, but I had I had got off the swim team because of school stuff. The whole time I could have went back, but I didn't know. So, <laughs> um, what made you want to do? What made you want to do YouTube? I wanted to do YouTube was because first of all, I'm funny and I got the best personality ever. Like when people meet me. I've been making people laugh, like, I just made people laugh. So I need to show the world, show you guys, you know what I'm saying, my beautiful personality. And plus, you know what I'm saying, um, I like, I wanted more followers. Like, I wanted to be like how I be seeing these people on Instagram. Like, they be, like, Instagram, like, is they called Instagram influencers or whatever they're called? Like, they be making money and stuff. And I'm, the whole time, I'm tired of, I'm tired of, um, like applying for all these jobs and i still like i still ain't i mean i have a job but i need another one because the job i got ain't cutting it but um like I'm t i am want to be my own boss basically i'm tired of just applying and applying and applying and i'm not getting hired or nobody i'm reaching i get interrupted somebody had called me my phone is on do not disturb because i don't want to do that again so where i had left off at it was was um why i wanted to do youtube well yeah so why i had left off at in the other video um was that like i want to be my own boss and i don't want to have to depend on nobody like oh, okay you work so and so or um i need you on this day i basically can do my own stuff because i'm also following you know what i'm saying it'd be fun because i barely go live i'm gonna go live i want y'all comment and ask me crazy stuff do stuff certain stuff it'd be fun um next question what is your channel going to be about? My channel is going to be about, like, me doing, somebody want me to do reaction videos. Um, I want to do, I'm going to do reaction videos. I'm going to do mukbangs. I might do certain pranks. I'm not doing it on my mom. Don't ask me because y'all try to get me killed. I'm not trying to die. 
So I'm do pranks on certain people, certain random pranks, um, like harmonizing games, uh, sister, sister tag with me and my sister, which is coming soon. Me trying certain foods, uh, me eating vegan food with my friend Haley. Shout out to Haley. Hey, yeah. Um, but she's a vegan. I'm gonna try vegan food. It looks decent. It looks good. Like, me doing just different stuff. Me being myself. Public interviews, asking people crazy stuff, asking them questions and stuff. I'm gonna do all that, cause it's me fun. Um, next question. Next question I got is, what are your fears in starting this channel? Whole time, I'm coming in confident. I'm coming out that bat swinging. I don't have any fears. If people don't, if people ain't gonna like me or ain't gonna like, like if people don't vibe to me or vibe to my channel or don't like me or comment, I don't give a damn. I don't give a damn. Okay. If you, I mean, if you won't watch me and still comment, thank you because you're still watching me at the end of the day. Um, negative comment. I don't, I, I don't give a damn. Okay. I just do not give a damn. So, I don't have any. That's the answer. I don't have any. Um. If you won the lottery, what would you do? If I won the lottery, <laughs> well, depending on how much, but if I won the lottery, first of all, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be dancing, I'm gonna be happy, you know what? But, but um, if I won the lottery, I'm putting it in a bank, but I'm most definitely, I'm buying me, I'm finna buy myself stuff. Buy me, y'all might buy me a car, buy me a car, I buy my sister a car. Uh, I'm just gonna be helpful, like, help my family out and stuff, and go on family trips, because y'all, I have never, ever been on a plane, I ain't never left Illinois. Not nothing. I mean, I've been in Missouri one time, so that that was the one time I left Illinois. But other than that, I have not been applying. That's gonna be mine. Yeah. Um. Next question: Cats or dogs? I like dogs. I can't stand cats. I'm scared of cats. I don't know why. Don't ask me why. I just don't like them. Ugh. What's your favorite game? Um. My favorite game is. Know. Favorite game is GTA. That's my favorite game. GTA. Um, I like uh, Friday the 13th. I got Xbox One, BTW. If y'all got Xbox One, hit me up. Let me know. And then we can play. Um, what is it? Hitman. I like Hitman too. I like. Um, what else I got in my game? I have Bully. I like the old school games. Don't, don't judge me. I like the old school games. My 360 I had all the, all the games. I had Watch Dogs. I had all that. Mm. What's the next question? Do you still watch cartoons? Duh. I love cartoons. Even the old ones. I watch the mostly old ones and certain new ones. <laughs> next question. What makes you mad? People act stupid. Act slow. Like if you tell them one thing, you like you already, <coughs> you already told them something. And then they act dumb. Like they didn't hear you. Like, I just told you. That makes me mad. What's the perfect job for you? A radio host. A radio anything. I want to become a radio host or something. Because I like talking. I love talking. I just talk, 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 talk. I love talking. It could be about not nothing. I love talking. And I like people make, I like making people laugh. <laughs> That's what I do. I'm goofy. Um... Proudest moment in high school, y'all. When I graduated high school, child, I cried on graduation. I couldn't help it, y'all. Because I was struggling in high school, child. I struggled. Like, what is it, sophomore year? I guess, like, I failed. So when it was time for junior year, I was still qualified as a sophomore. And then when it was senior year, I was still qualified as a junior. But luckily, yeah, I pushed through, child. I pushed through when I made it. And when it was like, it was getting a little close to graduation and I finally got boosted up to senior status. I was happy, y'all. Ooh, job. Um, are you the romantic type? Yeah, a little bit. Yes, I am. Cause like, I be looking at older shows like, like Sister, Sister and all them other 90 shows. You know how like the dudes was really, like they was really valuing like the girls back in the day. Like taking them out, taking them out for a picnic, holding their car door, holding their door. I like that. These dudes nowadays are fucking dumb. They're fucking dumb. They don't do none of that. 
they think about, oh, yep, I'm gonna do this and this and that, but I'm, I'm gonna hit. No, you're not. You're gonna get your, get your ass out the door. That's what you can hit, my brother. No. <laughs> what is at the top of your bucket list? Um, I said it earlier. I don't wanna travel. I don't wanna get on a plane. I don't give a damn where I'm going. It go. It could be to Florida. It could be to Mexico. It could be to Jamaica. I don't care. I want to get on a plane. Period. Um, have you ever met a famous person? Yeah, I have. I've met Miles Behavior when they came to Peoria. I sent them twice. I sent them to Chicago, but um, when they came to Peoria, had a little meet and greet. I met Tiffany Haddish. Um, who else? I'm trying to think. Have I met anybody else? I don't think so. I don't think I met anybody else. Um, Put on his hair in his bag. Um, yeah, it's If you could wish for anything or do anything, what would it be? I'm gonna be a millionaire, so I can. I wanna. I just wanna get back the whole time. After I buy my little stuff and do what I wanna do with my family, I'm, I'm gonna give back. So like, um, like people that ain't got it, like um, less fortunate people, because that's like that's. I just feel like that's the right thing to do instead of just being selfish. Like, no, I ain't gonna help them. I ain't gonna help the motherfuckers out. No, I actually, <laughs> I want them to help people out. Um, and next question. What chore do you hate the most? I hate doing fucking dishes. I can't stand dishes. I hate it. And my mom, she a chef, so she dang near cooks almost every every dang dish, every fork in there, every spoon, she uses every dish. And then we got these big pots and pans that really be bugging me. Like, they so big, I just feel like they make things look like it's a lot of dishes. Not somebody don't be a lot of dishes, but with them big ass pots and pans, it may it feel like it is. Um, next question. Would you rather go out or stay in? On a Saturday, um, it depends. I, I, I'm a homebody, so I always stay in. I stay in. I'm staying Monday through uh, Monday through Sunday, baby. I stay in now if I don't got work. But um, I'm a, I'm a, I'm gonna. I'd rather go out. If we got some plan. Oh shit! If we got some plan. We're going outside. I'm gonna go outside. I'm tired of staying in the house. Let that be known. Um. Yeah. The last question, everybody. Um, if you could travel time, where would you go? If I could travel time, I would want to go to. Actually, I would want to see like what my mom and my sister and my dad' life was like back in the day. Like, I would travel all the way back, like. I want to follow them around, <laughs> like you know how the movies. I want to follow them around. <laughs> like I would start with my dad first, cause my dad was a little thot day to day. So I would want to follow him around, like meet him as a kid, like as his, uh, like maybe like eight, eight when he was eight years old, like starting up to teenage years, and then, um, to grown years, and then that's cause he met my mom in Chicago. So when he met her. 18 years of probably DW. So when he married, like maybe he was 20, my mom was like in her teens or maybe 18, 19. I don't know, but I'm gonna follow him and then when meet up, follow him till he meet up my, till he meet my mom and then go follow my mom. I don't know, but follow my mom up to when she met my dad and my dad and stuff and then see how they was. And then boom, follow my sister around, see how her life was. Yeah, I, I, I'm one nosy person. I wanna see how this life went, how this life journey go. Cause I, I hear a lot of stories about it. So, um, I'm nosy. I want to see what, how it really was. Um, what's another question? I'm a, I'm making up a question off the top of my head because I wrote down the questions and I didn't think I was gonna fly by with these goddamn questions. Um, what's my favorite food? Favorite food? I like to eat, y'all. Skinny girl gotta eat. Skinny girl gotta eat. So um, I like seafood. I like fried chicken. I like roasted chicken. I like uh shit. Uh, I go to McDonald's. I just like eating. Um, I love cornbread. I love. I like soul food. I like love Mexican food. Not that I I feel like the authentic Mexican food is uh, is nasty to me. Like, cause they use corn shell. I hate corn shell. 
corn share is like a soggy, nasty, flavorless Dorito with the meat stuff on it. Ugh. It's nasty. Uh, I like flower shell and hard shell. The, you know, like the, the ones you get at the store, the, the Doritos Locos the Tacos. I like the Doritos Locos Tacos. Them fire. Uh, what else? Um, I like a lot of stuff, y'all. I ain't gonna name all that. Another question on um, what's my favorite song or favorite music? I like a lot. I'm gonna just name some artists because I ain't gonna name the song. I like Frank Ocean. I love my man Drake. That's my man. I love um, Charles Dan Gambino. I love the money. Um, the money Harris with his T.I. son. I like Beja from the OMG Girls. I like um, Shmino. I like I like a lot of people, y'all. I listen to a lot of underground artists, like people that like they they are known, but a lot of people don't know of them. And they be like, oh damn, who's that? I like Aerie Lennox. <coughs> Sorry, had to call. I like Ari, Ari Lennox. Ari Lennox, how you pronounce that girl name? Um, I love Tanisha, y'all. Tanisha just dropped the album. If y'all listen to her, and y'all listen to it, listen to it. It's called Songs For You. It's fire. I don't like, like, three songs, and I don't like an interlude, so that's, like, three songs. I don't like them, but everybody else, everything else is, like, fire. Um, shit, it's probably three or four songs I don't like. I can't remember. I love Doja Cat. Doja Cat is fire. If y'all don't know who that is, y'all go check her out. Um, she's in that song. Uh, move like I'm a cow, bitch. I'm a cow. I'm not a cat. I don't say meow. She, that's the girl that's in the song. Um, who else do I like? Um, I love Duran Bernard. That is my boy. Period. Boo boo. He can sing his ass off. I love him. Um, what else? Who else? That's it for now that I can think of. Um, let me think of another question. What's my favorite brand of shoes? I like Nikes. I wear Nikes. I like, um, yeah, I just like Nikes at the moment. Yeah, I like Nike. I don't, I don't like Jordans because I seen an article a long time ago, which was true, that Michael Jordan, like, that was, like, back in the day, a lot of people were dying over his shoes, like, the black people was killing each other for them stupid ass same ass shoes with the same color and everything different uh, the same shoe product with different colors sometimes the same color but making it lighter um he said on the on that thing about no siri didn't ask for you um siri got in the way god damn siri uh michael jordan said that he don't make his shoes for black kids he made them for rich white kids so guess what you can keep making them for them. Now. I mean, they, they can go bomb. Go ahead and bomb, but you're not getting my money. So go ahead. Keep making them for them little rich white kids then. How about that? So, um, what else I like? Um, what do I do on my spare time? My spare time? I be in the house. I be playing my game. I be on FaceTime. <laughs> I stay on FaceTime. Um, or I go to my grandma's house and hang with her or my cousins if I can. That's basically all. We be having fun, acting crazy, talking shit. That's what we do. I love talking shit. If you talk shit to me, you're most definitely gonna receive some shit talking back. Period, boo boo. <laughs> um, what's my favorite holiday? I think it gotta be Christmas. I like Christmas. I really like Christmas a lot. I just like Christmas because. I don't know, I like Christmas because cause, cause you get to go shopping for people. And, you know, sometimes I'm making it kind of be hard because it's like, dang, what do I want to get so-and-so? Or what do I want to get? Or sometimes if you ask them, they don't know what they want either. But um, I just like it. And plus, yeah, the gifts. I ain't going to lie. You get to give people stuff and gifts and stuff. Spend time with family. Uh, what was your fa uh, favorite subject in school? I ain't have a damn favorite subject. I was just luckily thinking about a fortunate of God of God that I passed <laughs> that I passed in class. I couldn't think. I mean, I, I think I kind of like history. Was what was it? Junior year? Yeah, junior year. I liked the history. That's because my teacher Miss Robinson. I I, just, I was I was like her favorite, even though we was at a road start. I didn't like her. I didn't like her at the beginning, but um, I just liked her because I don't know. Yeah, it's English. I, it's English a little bit. Like, if I understand it, if I get help and stuff, 
and just start the, and they teach me the easy way instead of a long of like the way the book wants you to teach it and a long explanation way that's gonna get me lost and i don't have time to be lost so i want the easy short version way so i can get it um who yeah. who was my favorite teacher and and i'm gonna start from my elementary all the way up so my favorite teacher at franklin days was miss bresco Miss Wallace, Miss Turnbull, that was my fifth grade teacher. Miss um, Miss um, Miss um, Ms. Halsey, that was my favorite teacher. Um, I feel like I'm missing some. Miss Garmin was my kindergarten teacher. I love her. That was my. I had two black teachers. It was Miss Garmin and Miss Baldwin. I liked them. They was my favorite kindergarten teachers. Um, what else? Somebody, somebody asked me today, how was my day? My day was decent. Um, I was off today because I made this video for y'all. I'm like, let me hurry up and make a video because people literally been texting me. Um, can, when you gonna make a video? Can you make a video? I'm going to y'all. So, Merry Christmas. Um, this is a uh, Vlogmas. <laughs> this is my, my Vlogmas. Vlogmas of day one, even though it's past. It's like day six, because it's the six. Day six of Vlogmas, but this is my first vlog, first video. So this is going to be my Vlogmas. Um, my day is actually decent. I slept beautifully good. My shoulder is kind of tense, but that's okay. Maybe it was the way I slept. Um, somebody asked, do I have a pet? Um, I got some fish. Um, I had, I used to have, how many? I used to have four in this tank, and now I only got down to two. Them fishes committed fish aside. The damn algae eater jumped his ass out the damn tank, and we saved him. Then we put it back in the tank. Yeah, the next day he died. He was dead to the bed. And then the goldfish I had, his ass was just really not having it, honey. He was diving his, like, face into the rock, and he just kept doing it and doing it. And his body was just, like, click. He broke his little back. Yeah, he was dead to the bed. They try to keep my mama trying to keep him like, oh no, he breathing, he moving. No, that water is making him move. I mean, his mouth was moving, but other than that, the water is making him move. He wasn't moving on his own. Polar goldfish. Um, name my artist that you can't stand. Um, I like. I kind of, I like Azalea Banks' music, like the, like the music that I want to vogue to, but her, she's annoying as hell, You're, she's annoying, she just be trying to, just be trying to trash talk every goddamn body, like, okay, first you're talking about Lizzo, okay, then she was talking about, um, she stayed talking about, like, Cardi B, and started my call, like, talking about everybody that's, that's making it in this damn industry, like, bro, Stop being mad. Okay, you're not making it. Stop being mad. Like, that's why when you was on Love and, I mean, Love and Hip Hop, on Wild and Out, they made that ass cry. With your sensitive ass. You stay talking shit, but you can't handle it. Okay. Well, get your ass out the kitchen if you can't take the fucking heat. Period. Um, um, I like Chris Brown, but I don't like his attitude. I do not like his personality. Well, no, I don't. Yeah, I don't like it the way he act. Like, when he act with females, um... My belief, when he act in general, he be doing petty shit, and that's annoying. Like, you're very talented, but the way you act, no. No, no, no. Um, who else I don't like as a celebrity? I don't like Kim Kardashian. I don't like the Jenners. I don't like none of them. I hate them with a passion. Like, y'all only, y'all was only famous because y'all was some hoes. And that's all y'all do for your life. Y'all not talented. Y'all not musically talented. Y'all not nothing talented. And I'm not even y'all not designer elite. Y'all can't fashion and none of that. Y'all just famous because y'all was hoes. That was the only thing about y'all that made y'all famous. Especially you, Kim. I don't like her at all. At all. And I mean that from the whole the the bottom of the heart, the whole part of the heart, even the little tubes in your little heart. I can't stand them at all. Um. Hmm. I think that's it for the people I, I can't stand. Somebody asked, who's my man crush? My man crush Monday. Okay, my name. My man crush, period, is Drake. That is my husband. 
I don't give a damn. That's my husband. So any, so any of y'all that's watching that say like Drake y'all husband, no, that's my husband. Been married for a long time. <laughs> Been married for a long time. Period. Um, I think that's it for that question. Um, let me think of another one. I might, I might end this. I might make that the last. No, I won't. I got two braids. Whoa, chap. Oh my god. Um, somebody asked that I eat today. No, I didn't. Um, I have steak and shake. I got steak and shake right here, and I got a banana milkshake. So I'm about to eat that after. I take this dang hair down, and I edit this goddamn video. You know what I'm saying? Make it beautiful, y'all. Y'all, I've been learning. <laughs> y'all gonna see. Y'all gonna see when I post this video, like my editing. I didn't did. I did a good job, y'all. I'm y'all gonna watch my intro and my outro and stuff I made. It's so fire. It's cute. I did a good job. Thank God for YouTube and the other people that know what to do. Uh huh. -huh. Somebody asked. Uh, will I do any Christmas activities for Vlogmas? Yes, I am. I I just made like an idea, like I came up with a couple of days ago. We have our Christmas tree up. Let me show you. Ooh, shit. Ooh, child. I don't know if you can see. Can you see? Yes. Okay, so we have our Christmas tree up, and we have a Christmas tree on the table because we're fancy and we're cute. But a Christmas tree over there. Um. I'm gonna we're gonna decorate it. Oops, we're gonna decorate it, and I wanna film it. Um, was decorating it, cause film. I was gonna film it, put it up too, but my dad was eager, and I didn't get the video as well. Um, and I have another idea. Well, I wanna do like cookies, like make cookies, and then put icing and stuff on it. With my cousin Nala, y'all have to see Nala. Nala's very, she's four. She's very, she's four, she's sassy, and she's very cute, and she's smart, very, very smart. So I'm going to do a video with her, too, with the with the cookie things. And also just a video with her by her, just with me and her. So y'all yeah, can get the feel for Nala. See how Nala acts. Maybe be a fan of Nala. Maybe support Nala. <laughs> support Nala. She already famous because certain people know her. Um, what else? Do I have a crush? Actually, I do have a crush. Oh God, no one's lying. <laughs> I'm just joking. Um, I had a crush on my neighbor. Um, for my friends who are watching this video, y'all know exactly what neighbor I'm was definitely talking about. I have a crush on my neighbor, but you know what I'm saying. He got a girlfriend at the moment, but that's okay because. I just wait for him. I, I I'm I'm gonna wait for him because at at this moment he not ready. He like to be he like to be a little fast. He like he like to be a little thought at the moment. So I'm gonna wait till he get mature and he ready. So old girl that got a spot. Old girl that's his girlfriend now. She just making my spot warm. So this is my man's. Well, maybe in the future. I don't know. Who, who knows? <laughs> who knows what the future holds? Um, what else? Um, somebody asked me, do I like the job I have now? It's all right, the job I have now, but they just made, they make so, they make too many rules and they make us feel like we some damn slaves. Like if you buy something, like say, like you want a lunch, you want a lunch break and you buy something and say so you don't want to finish it, but you want to take it home. They tell, they tell my son, you can't take that home. You can only eat it at... Uh, you can only eat it there. If I bought something, I'm going to take it home. Like y'all just sound crazy, bro. Um, what else? They 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 just be having stupid rules. And like I just felt like, man, that's that's why I did this. Why I want to become? I'm gonna become. I'm. I know I am. I turn myself into a YouTuber. I want to make my own channel because I'm gonna. I want to be my own boss. I'm gonna have my own rules. Like. I depend on myself. I'm not going to be, because that's retarded. If you pay for something, you can only eat it there and not take it home. No, no, motherfucker. I bought it. I'm going to take it home. Period. I bought it. 
or um there's another word they got oh they want you to pay for it even though you get half you get a half off on stuff but no i feel like work is if you're working hard and you if you work there and you're working hard and you gotta you don't gotta pay you don't have to pay for that you eat it you know? yeah but like people like if you cook if you're cooking on a grill, them people that, like, if you're a chef or anywhere, and if you cook the food, they don't got to pay for that. They are back there for a reason. They're going to eat it. They're going to make it, and they're going to eat it. So the same for the worker. If you work there, you do not got to pay. You might as well just eat, eat for free. Everybody should have, like, a little cold and all that. Because that's retarded. Like, I used to work at McDonald's, and I was I thought that was retarded. But managers and maintenance people, y'all eat for free. No, I'm a worker. I'm working my butt off too, so I, I want to eat for free too. They, they people crazy. I still have a couple of braids in here, but you know what? I'm done. I'm done with the oh child. I'm done with the big braids. So you know what, y'all? That was it for this video. Right, my first video. <laughs> this is my first video. Ooh, I'm so proud of myself. So, yeah, that's it for this video. Um, you know what I'm saying? Like, comment, subscribe, baby, subscribe. Click that damn bell, that ding a ling a ling the bell, bell, bell. Click that bell, period. So y'all get um, notifications. So when I post videos and stuff, you know what I'm saying? Y'all know how that work. Y'all be on YouTube. Y'all know how it go. So, yeah, I hope y'all like my video, my first little video. More is going to come. Like, I know people want to see my crazy mom on my video. And my crazy sister and my other crazy family members, they're going to be on here, too, very soon. <coughs> I'm just, yeah, you know, I'm putting the grind in. I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to blast y'all asses with a whole lot of videos. Y'all going to be like, oh, is that looking Corbin? Mm hmm I these motherfucking videos. Okay, okay. Yeah. But all right, y'all. I will catch y'all <coughs> on another time or another day. All right.